What did you want to talk to me about? I realize this is kind of a big ask, but I want to defend my WWE Championship against John Cena. Beating him would solidify my title reign and put me up there with some of the top champions of all time. So, any chance you can make that happen? You know, maybe give him one of those mandates to show up and face me? Yeah, I wish it was that easy. I mean, don't you think I've already tried to get Cena to appear on Raw before? He would bring instant star power along with a guaranteed ratings boost. But the reality is, he's busy with various TV and film projects and isn't interested in a return right now. So it's pretty much a lost cause. If I were you, I'd focus on something else. I wouldn't be where I am today if I just quit any time I was up against some adversity. I'm gonna get John Cena to come back to WWE and face me. And how are you going to do that? I'm gonna take a little trip down memory lane and revisit some of Cena's career highlights. Maybe that will get his attention. The Red Brand's rolling out the red carpet tonight as the current WWE Champion has invited none other than The Miz to Monday Night Raw to square off one-on-one. -on -one. It's a heck of a gambit, Michael, using The Miz to provoke one of WWE's greatest champions of all time, John Cena. And it's a gambit that could easily blow up in the WWE Champion's face. Just a barrage of stumps. Absolutely foolhardy to 
decision made there. That could be very costly. Don't know if the risk is worth it. So this whole Cena thing, hate to say I told you so, but you know what? I don't hate it at all. I told you so. I know how it looks from your perspective, but I promise it's going to work. I just need more time. And besides, I never said this would be easy. Fine, but if you don't get at least some kind of acknowledgement soon from Cena, then I'm pulling the plug. What's your next move? Spotlighting a major loss didn't seem to work. So I'm going to go in the other direction. Oh yeah. I actually got wind of your idea for this already. Trying to replicate Cena's first WWE Championship win by beating JBL? Don't think it's going to matter, but I'll make it happen. Fresh off a big win against The Miz, the WWE Champion will try to get John Cena's attention one more time tonight against one of Cena's former WrestleMania foes, JBL. JBL's a Hall of Famer that can still go in the ring and has a Hall of Fame voice to boot. Give that butt kiss and a rest, Saxton. I'm just stating facts, Corey. Ripcord Lariat. Both wrists captured and... Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Answering back. JBL showing no fear up there. Here we go. Oh, right in there. Climbing the turnbuckle now. First up top. JBL not looking so good here. He had to be prepared to take some damage tonight. Takes another trip to the skies, and it pays off once again. JBL managing to find some much... Oh, no. Now possibly setting up for a submission maneuver. He catches JBL in a count. Big four. JBL isn't being given any room to recover. But JBL can't allow this burst to hinder him. Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming next. Breaker. 
as the wrist trapped. And now a series of stomps and kicks. He's lining him up. JBL could be moments away from being beaten. Perched on the shoulders. Can JBL come back from that? Cover. One, two, three. And that'll about do it, folks. Here is your winner, Stunning. Oh, there was a potential opening with Cena, and you blew it. I don't think it's over. Are you crazy? He turned you down and then you insulted him? We can forget about a match. He probably won't even come back for a simple appearance now. So thanks for that. I'm telling you, I think I struck a nerve with him. And a man like that is too proud to just let that go. Let me do one more thing to get his attention, and if this doesn't work, then I'll move on. You've already tried one more thing, two or three times. He's gonna respect the fact that I won't give up. And then, you'll get your star power and your ratings boost that you want so bad. Ugh, what do you want to do? I want... The Undertaker. What? Let me explain. Cena was in the exact same position I'm in with The Undertaker a few years ago at WrestleMania. He was so desperate for a match he bought a ticket and sat in the audience waiting. When Undertaker eventually did appear, Cena lost in five minutes. I remember all that. What's your point? I want to send Cena a final message by doing what he couldn't do at WrestleMania. I want to defeat The Undertaker. That's really pushing it, but I think I can make it happen. And if Cena sticks to his word and never answers your challenge, then at least I'll get the ratings boost I was looking for with The Undertaker. And if Cena does change his mind, and even better. All right. Looks like you got yourself a match against the Phenom. Well, this is an extraordinary sight. Goosebump inducing. The awe-inspiring entrance of The Undertaker. Darkness has completely engulfed this entire building. Admit it, Byron, you're scared. A little bit. The WWE Champion has been on a roll, but tonight the champ will have to take his game to an entirely new level as he takes on the incomparable WWE legend, The Undertaker. It's the WWE Champion versus the Dead Man on Raw. This is huge! I have a feeling that even John Cena is going to be taking a break from his busy Hollywood schedule to watch this one. That's certainly the Champion's plan. Let's see if it works. Inflicting pain at will. Ah, the springboard attack fails to land. Undertaker gets reversed. Oh my gosh. Terminating knee 
smash. Oh, and a knee to the face. The dead man facing some danger. You can bet that first up top. A diving knee drop. Wow, springboard attack. Taking a chance one more time and landing with incredible impact. Oh. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Taking on some offense, but he expected as much. Ooh, this is kicking the spine. What a counter. The Undertaker finally finding an answer to that onslaught. If Undertaker was looking for a chance to turn this around, this could be it. Turns it around. A nice shot by The Undertaker. Now one of the best strikers in the business. Huge toss. Stomping. Ouch. He avoids the damage. Oh, what a right hand. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. First up top. And the cost of that is really showing now. There they go. Uh-oh. High risk cross body. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Three. Here he comes, sliding back in. Four. He's taking this to the floor now. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Oh, he's setting him up. Oh no, this is this is gonna be bad. Guys, get out of the way. Get out of the way. So oh, this has gotten out of hand. This has gone too far. This match definitely isn't for the fate of Hunt Saxton or table enthusiasts. Three. Setting it up. Thunderous clothesline. Can Undertaker withstand this onslaught? Taker needs to rise again. Helping you stay alive deep into the match. Setting him up for the flatliner. Setting up. Oh, He's getting a little better now. Oh, no, he can be caught here. Bad spot for him. Looking to apply pressure. After everything, these two men have been. Nice escape. Ready for Undertaker. Uh oh. On side kick. Both wrists captured. Oh, that was nasty. He's got him in the crosshairs. Oh, what a right hand! Undertaker's lost all power. The dead man is looking beatable. On the shoulders, feast your eyes. Somehow took down the Undertaker. The combo. One, two, three. A monumental victory tonight for the WWE Champion over the Phenom.
himself, The Undertaker. You never want to overlook an accomplishment like that, but I think the champion still has other things on his mind. John Cena, over the past few weeks, I've done everything I can to prove to you that I'm worthy of a match, that I'm worthy of your time. I mean, I just beat The Undertaker, which is something you couldn't do. So you know what? Maybe, maybe I've been looking at this the wrong way. Maybe it's not about proving that I'm worthy of your time. Maybe you're not worth mine. I have to agree with the WWE Champion here. It's time to move on from this whole John Cena thing. Wait a second. It's John Cena! The face of WWE has come home! I can't believe it. After weeks of unanswered challenges, and then Cena himself saying it wasn't going to happen, the WWE Champion has gotten John Cena to return to Monday Night Raw. And there you have it. Cena is back for one thing, the WWE Championship. Hey, this is a matchup that no one thought we'd ever see. And now it looks like it's happening. This is going to be one for the ages. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Championship. This is going to be good. Time to do it one time again. Let's go to work. Listen to this place. Since 2003, I don't know if any other superstar has defined WWE in the same way as John Cena. Yeah, a man who's been defined by his passion, a man who's been defined by his work ethic, and a man who has been defined by Hall of Fame success here in WWE. Introducing the challenger from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena! And introducing the champion from Calcutta, India, weighing in at 244 pounds, he is the WWE Champion, stunning! That's what it's all about, the WWE Championship. The challenger wanted this opportunity, now he's got it. Well, it's always fun to go to the zoo until you fall into the lion's den. 
The challenger had better sharpen his teeth. Weeks of grueling battles have all led the WWE Champion to this moment. A chance to etch his name into the WWE history books against the one and only John Cena. Talk about box office. Two of the biggest draws in sports entertainment are fighting for the right to call themselves the true face of WWE. You want to talk faces? The WWE Champion finally got his wish. A chance to carve his mug right up there on the WWE's Mount Rushmore. Just like that, Cena gets intercepted. Poised and ready to strike. No way else. Wrecking ball. Drop kick. That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear. Absolute reckless Ooh. abandon. All right, sliding back in. He's heading up top, thinking big. Perched up top, a diving knee drop. Whoa, just floating through the air. Consecutive high-risk maneuvers, and the pace of this match has certainly picked up. An uninterrupted surge against Cena here. Cena has to find a way to reassert himself. Was mounted with punches and not oh a nasty stop to finish it off. Oh. Oh. Kicks to the lower back, clutching the wrist. Just absolutely punishing their opponent here relentlessly. His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. Place to be for the challenger. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. The stomp in every single part of his body. The fight is being brought right to him. Yeah, but he's always one counter away from changing things. And Cena crashes to the outside. Top rope, putting it all. First up top. Whoa, look out! That's gravity taking a break before coming down like thunder. Oh, great. Rearranging our ringside furniture here. Here on the announce desk. What a mess. Oh, he creates some separation with power. They just punch him in the chest. Kick to the midsection. Sunset flip. No! Into a power He's in under the ropes. He catches Cena with a counter. Nasty right hand. It's a go into the floor. Here we go. Oh, no. That was an absolutely haphazard, uncalculated risk. And I have no doubt they're going to pay dearly for it. Two. Look at this now, draping his opponent over the announce desk. How do you survive The announce table was just absolutely decimated. That's how much this match means to them. Nothing and no one is safe. Oh, foot just stomping down. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Look at the power from Cena. Face first. Spiked with a Michinoku driver. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Oh. Enough already. Oh. 
Cena ready to close it out. You can't see me. And the five knuckle shuffle. The champ's shoulders are down. And the pin is broken by the champion. Still going to take a massive effort to keep him down. Here's Cena. Absolutely powerless. Up and down the hard way. Oh, oh, oh gosh. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. And if you're getting a victory like that, you gotta be feeling pretty good about yourself. Cena lost. <laughs> Mr. Never Give Up should have quit before the match even started. The following contest is a last man standing match and is for the WWE Championship. It Welcome to what should be one of the most brutal championship matches we've ever seen between the defending WWE Champion and one of the most decorated superstars in WWE history, John Cena, as they face off in a last man standing match. That means that one of these two extraordinary athletes will need to keep the other down for a full 10 count to walk out of here tonight with the title. It's hard enough keeping Cena down for a three count, let alone 10. Let's see if the WWE Champion has what it takes to pull it off. Oh, ow! Corner. 
Climbing up top, he's got big plans. Perched up top. Diving knee drop. Cena now taking the brunt of the attack. Cena's just trying to weather the storm. the WWE Universe right now. Four. Five. Six. Count still climbing. We're up to seven now. Eight. And he'll stand to break the count and keep this one going. The challenger not looking good right now. And we're deep into this last man standing match now. Every blow makes it harder and harder to stay off the ground. Up into the torture rack. Now that was why there's a champ. right now from all those chants and cheers. Seven. And there's seven. It's getting close. Eight. That stops the count, so this match will... Oh. Cena dodges out of that. He moves just in time. Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. Oh. With authority! Big time close line. The head side up a little on the chair. On loads with the boot. Feeling that more work needs to be done here. Heading up, he's thinking back. First up top. Diving knee drop. Cena's looking absolutely powerless. Is this really it? Eight. Nine. Ten. That's it. The champ stays the champ. Here he 